Yeah, I just started up this pile of shit and these are the sounds I'm greeted with. Just a cacophony of Vuvuzelas having sex. Sounded like a clan of angry Tuscan raiders. Or four pigs fighting over a trombone. Holy shit. If that isn't the makings of a great horror title, I just don't know what are. I'm so incredibly excited for this one now. That really got me hyped up. Wow, it's incredibly dark. My wife left me three years ago for another man. I've been lonely ever since. Is he smiling? Why is he... Why is he gritting his teeth like this? Oh, wow. Yeah, this man looks like a rat. Well, I think I, I, think I can uh, sniff out the reason... One of the main reasons your wife left you. I don't know anything about you personally, but... But damn. Three years. Not one date. Not one kiss. Not one embrace. Well, maybe if you would stop showing your teeth like you're a dog ready to attack, you'd find a little bit more success out there. I also don't know why he looks so oily. This character model looks like he's covered in a thick film of grease. There's a lot of things you could be doing right now to better yourself, my friend. There's no way those are titties. Those are some just way over-filled water balloons ready to burst. This, this blows anime out of the water here. Eat your heart out all animes with big busty female leads. This one takes the cake. Oh baby, I'm in the game now. Finally, let's get after it. This is one of the games where the mouse doesn't stay in the game. Great. The Daily Scooper, huh? Yeah, I'll pick that up. It's not letting me pick. There we go. Pretty simple, I guess. Man, this is just such a massive pet peeve of mine where the game doesn't keep the mouse in the game. So then I'll always click off the screen and open 12 different files nearly post nudes on Twitter by accident just because I'm trying to click shit in the game but I've already clicked somewhere in the background. I can't pick up that little vibrator. I'm fucking trying to find the front door but it's very difficult when it's pitch black, can't see shit. Oh, is this it? Looks like the porch out there so that means this one has to be the front door to it. Can I not close it? Did I close it? I can't see anything. How about we turn on a few lights? Did I move into a house that has no lights? Not even some candles? Can't even wing tune the door shut. This is the front door, right? Yeah, this looks like the like a little porch outside. This is one of the darkest games I've ever played. I can't make heads or tails of what I'm looking at or where I'm supposed to go. And also, it doesn't help that the stupid fucking flashlight that's emanating from my nipples here is not following my mouse movements or my body movements. It's got a fucking mind of its own. It's like I'm playing a little crane game here for a stuffed animal, but instead with light in a dark room. Yep, this is- this is gonna be a rough one. But I can do it. This has to be the front door. What an interesting- what an interesting house setup here. He's got his bed just in the middle of the fucking main room here with his front door in front of him. He's got everything crammed in here, yikes. It's that big city living for you. Maybe I'd be better off trying echolocation here. No, there's no echoes. What are the odds? Me fucking turkey noising into my mic didn't help anything. Who would have guessed? Did I forget the controls? I thought for sure it was left click to interact with shit. Am I wrong? Am I wrong about this even being the front door? Is this even a door? Maybe... Maybe I'm just like a fucking mirage in the desert. But instead of being so hot and dehydrated, it's just so fucking dark. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I don't know what the blue moist meter at the top left is either. I don't know what that's measuring. Stamina, maybe? Patience? How long can you stand to be in this sensory deprivation tank of a game? The amount of times I've already clicked off this game is astounding. <sighs> this blows. What am I supposed to do? Do I sing to the door to make it close? This is the worst fucking horror game I've ever played. It's too dark to move around and I don't want to leave this door because I'm convinced it's the front door. And if I leave this area, I might never be able to find my way back. At least give me like a... Like a, a stick to poke around with to feel my way through. Now I can't even pick up the daily scooper. Oh, there we go. It is left-click to interact. What? 
Why won't the fucking doors close? Is it this one? Do I have to lock this? No, it can't be. This is stupid. This is just dumb. I'm not having any fun. If you're listening to this, sexy hiking- or uh, sexy serial killer devs, I'm not having any fun with your game. What, is, what have you done with this? Not that it was a good premise to begin with, but god, this is the worst execution of even a bad idea I've ever seen. It's way too fucking dark with the flashlight not even following me. I'd be better off just pissing in 360 degrees and measuring the distance between where the piss lands, judging by the sound based on my location, and then running that through Pythagorean theorem, as well as walking it back down the Bose-Einstein condensate. Oh, this is a, it's a hallway. Okay, so it wasn't a, it wasn't a porch. Man, that this whole dilemma could have been solved if only it was a little bit brighter, or maybe the flashlight a bit a little bit stronger, or a little bit more accurate following my fucking movements. Said I'm wandering around like a fucking idiot in one single room, convinced I'm near the porch. Holy shit! Ugh. And I apparently live in the world's largest house. It's like the Winchester Mansion. No rhyme or reason to its design. Is this the front door? Oh no, I'm not falling for that old practical joke again. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, I'll end up playing Steam's worst horror game. I don't know where to go. As is typical with this game so far. Can I just chug all these and forget that I'm playing this? Maybe this way. There's like a secret door here. Alright, let's go, Scooby-Doo. Time to investigate this mystery. This house is so big, why would you even do this? What are you thinking? No, that's not it. That's the uh, the trash room where we just drop our, our trash bags full of body parts. Yum. Oh, what's even the point of the door if I can just go around this way? Now they just put doors in there to fuck with me. Me personally, they're they're designing this level as I'm playing it, and they're making it darker by the second. Oh, I found the front door. Oh no! Wow, they got me good. Now, what the fuck was that sound effect? I love that. That's like the end of the Ed Ed Nettie intro. That made it all worth it. All right, I I see what you were going for. It was the the slow burn. Fucking great sound effects there, I like that. I'm done playing this.